Q&A today. Um, I don't have a lot of questions, so some of them I'm going to have to like find and just answer them just because. I put out like a few posts about I'm doing a Q&A, but everybody don't want to participate. I, had, I think I only had like four people actually ask me a question that I'm going to be answering today. Um, so let's get started. <laughs> What's something you wish men or women did more of? I wish men would be, and it's not all of them. I wish those some men were more like respectful to women. Because a lot of men do take advantage of a softness of a female. And I'm not saying all females are soft. You know, you got the hard up bitches, you know, the cutty bitches, you know. But everybody's made differently. They accept things differently. They do things differently. But some men, they just, because they're here sometimes, they let that get over their head. And they just like, man, I'm a man. I do what I want. She say what I say. It go how it go. No, nigga. No, no. I wish women were more nice to other women and they could be mean to men too but some women they just they're assholes you literally could look at a female for five seconds and they'll just mean mug you like like you looking at <laughs> i wish they were more nice like today i went to burger king and this young uh young lady she was uh putting my stuff up and just putting everything in. And I just looked at her. She just she kind of just looked upset for whatever reason. I just was like, you are so gorgeous. And she hit that big ass dumb ass with the braces. And she just, I love that. I love the good energy sharing that with people. And I wish women did more of it. It's like you get on social media or you're out in public. And it's always a female that's just like, ew. <laughs> like, stop. Compliment her. Say she's gorgeous. Hey, you're beautiful. I love your smile. I did a whole lot of that when I was at that festival. Y'all got to see them clips from that festival. That festival was fun. <clears throat> so, um, do you like TV shows? I don't watch TV, but from when I used to watch TV, I used to watch uh, cartoons. All the time, especially Spongebob. Spongebob is my number one favorite. I will watch that any day, even today. Um, all of the Nick Jr. things, the Nick 2s, Nickelodeon, Cartoon Network, Boomerang, all of those old cartoons. Bugs, Bunny, and all that. I could watch it any day. Any day. And that's about it. Okay, so... Uh, do you like roller coasters? Yes, I love roller coasters. If I go to a theme park, I'm getting on roller coasters. If I go to Six Flags, the first one I'm getting on is the Joker's Jinx. Yeah. What is your best friend's name? These are like random questions. I have two best friends. Um, one name is Jordan and one name is Amber. Uh, we've been friends for I don't know how many years at this point. Maybe two, three years. Probably three years, four. I don't know. We've been friends. <laughs> and it's like, they my friends. <laughs> they are the real ones. I can honestly say that they are the real ones. They've been down. They've been through thick and thin. Like, we've had our ups. we had our downs. we had our fallouts. But at the end of the day, if I hit their line, they're going to answer. If they hit my line, I'm going to answer regardless, you know. Check up on your friends. Just because y'all not talking for a few days, don't just assume that they are. You always check up on them and see if they are. You never know what they're going through because sometimes they don't want to talk about it. Describe describe your temper with a weapon. <laughs> okay. A shotgun. A shot water gun. <laughs> it's going to have the whole body and shape of a shotgun. But it squirt out water. <laughs> Because my facial expressions say so, so much. And I don't do much. Like, when I'm at that point where I'm just like, ah, nah. It's not, I don't do no crazy shit. Like, start throwing TVs. It's just, I might raise my voice and I might cry like a little bitch. That's about it. 
all right do you have a tattoo i have two tattoos um one of them is a couple of hearts and the other one is a janky butterfly <laughs> that one i gotta get covered up i'm gonna have a tattoo day soon hopefully short hair or long hair um i like long hair or medium like Right now, my hair, I feel like it's short, but it keeps shrinking because it's natural and it does stuff because, you know, I think hair that comes to like right here is really, I like that. That's cute. You know, I don't, I don't have that as you see. It don't work like that here. What's your favorite candle scent? I love fruity scents. So my house smells like apples. I have like apples and cinnamon melts. I have green apple candles. I have apple pie. Yeah, I like apples. So I guess you could just say apple, but I really like fruity smells. So if it's fruity, I'm going to like it. I'm going to buy it. So if it's mango, definitely. If it's mango, I'm definitely going to get it. I love mango. Do you believe in karma? I definitely believe in karma. I definitely do. But I don't believe it to the extent where it's like, I know this is definitely going to happen to you because you did this. I feel like everything happens for a reason. You know, if you steal out of your best friend's purse and you never tell them. One day, I feel like you're going to lose that same exact amount of money or somebody's going to steal money from you. So I feel like it's like that. I mean, of course, karma can come in any way possible so i just felt like that was a good example i don't know if it was or wasn't but let's either here or there um short guy or tall guy i cannot date a guy shorter than me no offense by the way i am 4 11 and a half i just can't i just i will make fun of you every day like look at you your space heater forehead ass bitch. What the fuck you going to do? You fucking toddler ass bitch. Like, <laughs> we will be fighting every day because I'm going to be making fun of him. All right. I like, I like him tall so I can climb all over him like a jungle gym. I'm sorry. <laughs> Proud, bleh. Proudest moment in high school. I don't think I had one. I hated high school. It was awful have you ever had best friend drama yes 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 indeed i definitely had best friend drama before i'm not gonna get too much into detail because that's personal between me and those friends but you know shit happens if you won a lottery what would you do if i won the lottery i'll go cash my shit and go to work Take my ass right back to Amazon like it's an ordinary ass day. I don't care. <laughs> like, like it's an ordinary day. I don't. People, I'm going to buy a yacht. I'm going to buy a boat. I'm going to buy a car. I'm going to buy a whole big ass dumb ass house. I'm not. I'm not doing all that. Now, when I feel like I'm ready to go and move and do all that, I mean, yeah, I'll do it. But I'm going to live an ordinary life. I'm not going to act like I'm luxury, you know, with the sunglasses on. Like, yeah, bitch, I'm in the limo. Limo taking me everywhere. Oh, my God, I saw that. Um, how many pillows do you sleep with? I sleep with two. I have a favorite side of the bed. I always seem to put my bed up against a wall. I guess because it's just, I sleep balled up like a, like a fucking fetus. Like, I, that is the comfortablest position for me. I'm so comfy like that. And um, I have a giant unicorn that is pressed up against the wall. So I have a cushion right there. And then um, I have the one pillow that I'm laying my head on. And if I'm feeling like really lonely or I guess anxious or just, I don't know, just uneasy, I take my second pillow and I put it on the other side of me. And it just feels like somebody's laying there next to me. Because sometimes I'd be lonely. I'd be a lonely bitch, okay? I'm lonely sometimes. <laughs> do you have pets yes i have eight pets i have six ferrets one turtle one gerbil um what's your favorite holiday my favorite holiday is i want to say christmas christmas is my favorite not for just the gifts itself like 
I love the gifts. I love giving gifts. Um, it's more of it makes me feel at home. Because um, when I was just a little girl, my mom and dad, they would go overboard with Christmas, okay? I'd be asleep, and my dad would come wake me up and carry me downstairs. And it would be the living room into the, into the dining room full of toys. Full of toys from one side to the other, under the tree, all the way back into the corner, on the couch for me. We would bake cookies, listen to the old school music, the old Christmas songs, you know, just really enjoying childhood. And it's like now that I'm an adult and I no longer have my parents with me, I, you know, I try to recreate those memories and feel at home when Christmas comes around. So I go overboard. I buy the lights. I buy the decorations. And if I'm dating someone, I try to make their Christmas feel like my Christmas. That is my goal when it comes to <laughs> when it comes to Christmas. Like I love it. It's my favorite. And it's like I don't really ask anybody for anything for Christmas. And it's like I just really want to make it special. And I like, I don't know this year I might be by myself for Christmas and I'm still gonna have fun I'm gonna decorate I'm gonna put stuff up I'm gonna go overboard still and if it's me by myself I'm gonna make my Christmas the best Christmas by myself I'm gonna have some wine and I'm gonna spend more than a dime um do you want children I do want children I want three children um when I was younger I said I wanted three children because I wanted one to like me, one to like dad, and then one to like the both of us. That's not going to work. And <laughs> I know it's not going to work. My genes are strong. And I don't know, you know, if if I get married and I do have children, I don't think it's going to work like that. I think they're all going to look like me. Or if the person has strong genes too, maybe, maybe. But I feel like they're just going to look alike. They, everybody just going to look alike because... My brother, we look like twins. My younger brother, triplets. My younger sister, just all together. And then my brother, he had kids. And them goddamn kids look like me. We all look alike. Throw us away, we're clones. What are the main fears of starting this channel? Uh, I don't really have a fear. I'm just going for it. You know, see where it takes me. If I make it far, yay, congratulations to me. If... I don't, yay, it's okay, congratulations to me, you know, and then it's, this is something that I can still look at, like, hey, you know, I tried YouTube, it didn't really go anywhere, so it's all right, <laughs> I tried, this video is probably long, so I'm gonna have to edit it like crazy, so don't forget to like, subscribe, share, comment down below if you got any ideas, or if you want me to do something different, Okay, bye. <laughs>